Hello everyone and welcome back to another weekly shop. It's just been delivered. I got the nine till 10 slot and it came just before 10 to nine. So that was brilliant, get it out of the way and then I can get on with my day. I spent, how much did I spend? Well, it doesn't tell me the exact amount here. I spent, oh. It says here, cost of total to charge £70.64. Okay, so that's what I spent. So let's just dive straight in and show you what I got. So the normal Miss Molly's chocolate chip cake bars. My daughter loves these, as does my husband for his work, so they're always handy to have. They're only 47 pence. The usual mushrooms, because they can go in anything and everything. Normal milks. We've got a smaller, a big milk and a smaller one, because my daughter doesn't tend to get through two of these, actually, at the moment. So I thought get a big and a small. Then the semi-skimmed for the husband and the orange juice. Then we've got a few bits of salad here. The lamb's lettuce, sweet and crunchy salad, and then the mixed leaf as well. 25th, 26th of may is the date that's not what's the date today i think it's the 23rd so it's not too bad we got a bonus here i ordered one lot of smoked salmon it was on offer from three pound fifty down to three pounds and they gave us two so that was a bonus lovely my little one will be pleased with that because she does like having a bit of salmon the little apples, which are perfect size for a toddler. So I'll just wash those, put them in the fruit bowl, and then if she wants one, she can have one. The standard pizza, 49 pence. Uh, bacon here, on offer, it was two pounds, should have been 250. Cucumber for the salads, 42 pence, I believe. Got some smoked cheese. I think this was £1.60. These look really nice. These were on Clank Card offer as well. I think they were £2 instead of £3. Mozzarella and pesto corn escallops. And I've got two there. I might give one to my mum. She's veggie. I'll freeze it for when she comes over. I had something similar to this the other week. It was the cheese and broccoli one. Done it for my husband and he hadn't even realised he thought it was chicken. So I thought if if that's the case, then I'll do it more often. So we've got those there. They're freezable, so that's great. I have noticed quite a lot of things going up in price, actually. Let me know in the comments below. Is that something that you've noticed? Because last week, the sour cream and chive dip was 79 pence. And now this week, it's £1.20. So I think that's quite a big difference, to be honest. You know, 41p. And the, the size isn't any different, so I think that's that's quite a lot to go up by. And what else did I notice was different? Oh, and these crisps, last week they were 90p, this week £1. So it does all add up, you know, if you've got everything going up by a couple of pence. I've got some breadsticks, my little one likes to snack on these. These um, for the special club card price for, were 90p, normally a pound. And last week on the club card price, they were 80 or 85 pence. So again, you know, let me know. Does this keep happening to everybody else? Have you noticed prices everywhere you go going up? Some double cream for our strawberries um, on Sunday at the mother-in-law's. And these were on club card offer, normally £1.80 down to £1.20. So if you're just having the freezer, so we've got one sovereign fried one sweet and sticky barbecue and then one original my daughter likes these as well so they're handy just to do that or my husband likes them so if we're doing like a pasta bake and he wants a bit of meat then i can just do one of those on the side the cheese we quite like that cheese the salt and vinegar crisps as i said bunny bites these are really nice better than pom bears in my opinion they have a lot more flavor you get more in a pack and there's like more crunch to them now I know that the sizes of the ham are so big, I've just got the one pack, 
40 slices and I think that was £1.59. I believe that was an Aldi price match. Some Sun Trail Farm grapes, that was £1.09. So we'll see if my little one likes those. Some Hearty Food, um, which is like their own brand. Pasta, 29 pence for 500 grams, which is very good. Again, another Aldi price match. Some brioche burger buns to go with our chicken burgers that I got from M&S. I uploaded yesterday um, a cheeky M&S treat food haul. So that's why it might not look like there's lots of meals to go with things here because I got some stuff in that. So I amended this shop for today. Um, but this won't be going up until next week because I've got last week's food delivery going up in a couple of days, just to let you know. Some sea salt uh, crackers, a couple of bananas here, the fins for my husband's lunch. Can you tell we like bagels? <laughs> they were on club card deal, uh, usually £1.60 and on club card price for one twenty or one twenty five. So I will freeze two and one we will get through this weekend. We've got my um, father-in-law over today to help out in the garden. So him and my husband will have a bagel, um, bacon bagel today. And then tomorrow, the three of us will have um, the salmon and cream cheese bagel. So that's one lot gone. One for now, two for later. These one club card price, £1.75 instead of £2.25. I still think, you know, oh, well, what £2.25 is a lot of money. You're only getting five in a pack. These very rarely come up on club card price. So I thought when they did, I'd get them because my little one does like them and they're a little treat. And they're one of your five a day and they taste nice. They taste like little sweeties. So she's got a raspberry one and a black currant one. And we've got a pack of potatoes. We'll probably have a jack of potatoes, cheese and beans one night for dinner. The Tesco's own reduced fat pesto. Now, I normally love my home pride creamy tomato pasta bake sauce, which is normally, how much is that normally? Oh, I'm not sure. I think £1.80 and then it goes down to like £1.20 in club card price. But Tesco's one was 75p. So I thought instead of stocking up on the club card price, I will try this out. If I like it, then I will just use this in future because it's cheaper, quite a bit cheaper. And... Um, but if not, if we don't like it this week, and I believe the Home Pride offer is still on for another week, so then I'll stock up on the one that we do like. But I'm really hoping this will be successful. Has anybody tried this? Please let me know. Four for £1.20, the reduced um, sugar and salt baked beans. Just Tesco's own. I wanted to get the normal ones. I didn't have them, and I wasn't going to pay £3 for a pack of four. Branston beans or Heinz, they sort of taste the same to us anyway. So we got these ones. I think we've tried it before, it's not a problem. This we really like, it's the Pizza Express house light dressing. I don't seem to ever see this on offer, which is annoying. So it's £2.30 and we get through this quite quickly with salads. I did try the Tesco's own Caesar salad dressing as a change but which was half the price well no it was a fraction of the price it was 75p but no i just prefer this and if it means that i'm going to eat more salad then i should just buy that got some rolos there some ready salted crisps these were 85 pence i did try and get the um brand lower than this i believe it's the stockwell brand brand which is 65 pence but they were out of stock so we have these which is fine ready sorted crisps are ready sorted crisps um some garlic and coriander naan breads a pack of the raisin crispy slices oh no it says cinnamon sprinkle these are for my daughter i'll have to see if she'll like those i'm not sure if she'll like the cinnamon we'll try if not, they'll be going elsewhere. Giant box of cornflakes that was on offer for £2 something. Husband was uh, running low on the cereals, so he's got that because that was on offer. Um, a tikka masala cooking sauce. thought we'd try that. I was running low on my spices, 
So this was on offer, the East End um, brand, for 79p for 100 grams of paprika. They had one of these of the paprika up for sale, but it was like 80 pence. And I just thought, no, I'm going to pay the same price, but get a lot more and just refill my old jar. So that's what that's about. Some garlic granules, some mild chili powder as well. I believe these were both in the region of like 60 and 80p. And then finally, I thought I would try these. Uh, white grape and elderflower, bubbly and refreshing. Don't know if they're new. It's £1.50 per bottle, so I thought that was quite reasonable. They're probably similar to like a schler, that kind of thing. And then this one is the rosé grape and rhubarb. So I thought for the summer, that, tastes, that should taste really nice and refreshing. So yes, this is the overall of what I got. I mean, is this good for £70? I'm not so sure. I mean, they haven't got a lot of meat. We've got a bit of bacon there, some ham there, the chicken's there. I suppose we've got two lots of salmon, that was bonus. I am noticing that the Tesco Club card points do seem to rack up a lot quicker than the Sainsbury's Nectar card points. So that's a bonus. Um, but yeah, this is everything that we've got. Please do let me know in the comments, have you noticed prices going up? What are you doing about it to try and keep costs down? So I really, I'm not sure, you know, what to do now. We've, we're locked into this six month price plan with Tesco's. So going to Audi just isn't really an option because, you know, I'm locked in. I'll be paying eight pounds a month for nothing then. A lot of the stuff I do get on Audi, Audi price match anyway, or the club card points or the Tesco's branded stuff. So... I'm really not sure where to go from here. So if you've got any tips and tricks on how to save a bit of money or other than what I'm already doing, please do let me know. Anyway, for the time being, do take care. Do give this a big thumbs up if it's something that you like. Please do subscribe because I'd love to have you here. And until the next one, goodbye.